Thank you so much. Well, you guys, you know and we know how important it is to get our young ladies involved yeah. in science, tech, engineering, and math. And we are excited to say that our next guest is championing that on in a very confident way, and we can all follow suit. Help me welcome to the show Rebecca Borman. She's the president of Women and High Tech. Ah, uh, thank you so much. Yes. I'm so excited well, to be here. This is exciting stuff. I, I gotta love tell that you. we were just talking about the science of botany. <laughs> well, yeah, that's true. It's all around us, isn't it? And Absolutely. there's so much to learn. Um, you, my dear, already have such an energy about you. You. Oh, I've got to, I, I want to do what you're doing. So tell us about women in high tech and for those that don't know. Yeah, I'd love to. So Women in High Tech is a nonprofit organization that was founded here in Indiana in 1999 oh. by an Eli Lilly scientist and an IU academic. These women kind of looked around and said, there's not a lot of women. What can we do? And they decided to do something about it and founded our organization. Well, that's incredible. Yes. So what do you guys do as an organization? Yeah. So our mission is to change the landscape of women represented in STEM to be equally mm -hmm. inclusive to all. So we do that in a few ways. One, by supporting professional and collegiate women in STEM with um, networking events, professional development. We have a biannual Leading Light Awards that where we honor women in STEM and our diversity and inclusion champions and our male allies. Yeah. <laughs> Don't want to leave them out. That's right. I like that nod. We need, we need everyone to help us all rise together. Yeah. And we also um, have, have a part of our mission is to inspire K through 12 girls to take an interest in oh, STEM. So, so important. Yeah. So we, so we have um, a couple of our own events where we um, have like hands-on activities to teach the girls about science and tech and engineering and math with coding and DNA and oh my goodness. And things like that. You need to come back on every time you have one of those events. Oh, yes, we, we need to know about to. it and, and how other people can get involved. I'm guessing scholarships are also a part of what you do. We do. We do. We um, we raise um, um, funds through our corporate spo um, corporate sponsorships. Uh -huh. And um, I'm happy to say that last year in 2020, um, during our virtual Leading Light Awards Gala, we gave away over $55,000 in scholarships wow. to 17 Indiana women and girls. Okay. Yes. Was this one of them? Yes, yes. Imagine? This was one of them. Purdue and U University. We um, gave um, high school senior scholarships, undergraduate, graduate, and professional development. That's um, incredible. Yeah. It, it was the most money we've given away at one award ever. And so Layla LaJoy Layla. Robinson, she. this LaJoy. was one of our new scholarships, um, our In This Together scholarship, where it was our first ever member-funded scholarship. And, and she got over $3,300 from that scholarship. Oh, that's incredible. How good for those girls. Now, you and we have another one, Amanda, but I want to make sure to get to the multicultural event yes. because you're planning that. It's scheduled. It's coming yes. up. We can take part. Tell us about yes, it. Yes, yes, please. We'd love for you all to join us. So this is going to be our first in-person event since um, the start of the pandemic. Oh, that's wonderful. And this is our inaugural multicultural celebration. Oh. It's going to be on June 9th at the Indiana State Museum in the beautiful Great Hall and that, um, and oh. also the terrace like along the canal. I love that place. Yes. And this event really, like, it is a celebration of our diversity, diversity of our cultures, diversity of our backgrounds and our stems. We're going to have multicultural food. We're going to have the chamber um, indie band for music. Wow. We're going to talk about um, all the women in STEM and the great impacts they've had. Um, this is for men and women. So mm -hmm. everybody, please come out. You can get your tickets on our website at womeninhitech.org. And we're also going to be honoring two high school students with um, a scholarship scholarships to STEM camps That's here incredible. in the city. Incredible. Yeah. Incredible. Okay, so the event, we can get tickets right now. Uh, that just sounds so oh fun. My gosh. And Come. doesn't she make STEM just so <laughs> magnetizing, just so exciting. I just I want to go where you're going. Um, wonderful. Okay, anything else we need to know? Give us that website again. Yes, a website is womeninhitech.org. You got it there on the screen Yes, as well. thank you. And oh. the other thing is um, go to our website and um, hit the subscribe for our email list, and you'll learn about our other virtual events, volunteering opportunities. Okay. We, we actually have a call out for um, new board members. So oh, lots of ways we can involved. get involved being a part of women and high tech. Thank you so much, Rebecca. Um, Randy and Amber, or Ramber, I guess I should call you guys now. We love the movers and the shakers, and we've got a lot of them in studio today. <laughs>